Hello, my name is Rodney Whitaker. I picked a piece that I wrote 20 years ago for the great pianist John Lewis, and I wrote it for him as a prayer. I selected this piece primarily because I wanted it to offer it as a prayer to our nation, and especially to our students of color and community of color, just so that they, in the resistance and to fight for freedom and equality, that we're able to also reflect and meditate in prayer because we need as much of that as possible. We need wholeness. In this piece, it's, it's really about meditation. I think about, when I think about performing this piece, I think about our ancestors that have come before us, people like Malcolm X and Martin Luther King and freedom fighters like Sojourner Truth and Harriet Tubman and what they must have had on their mind and what they must have reflected on in the struggle for freedom and equality. I think the, the most important discussion that we have to have is that all people deserve to be free. And we have never, in the 400 plus years of history in America, black people don't live with the freedom that other Americans are afforded. And so the discussion has to be about equality and freedom and justice. So in, in the civil rights struggle, there's so many musicians that were inspired to write music during this time. But the one that I would suggest that folks listen to is a piece called We Insist, Freedom Now, written by Max Roach and Oscar Brown Jr., which featured vocalist Abby Lincoln. And in this piece, it's an it's a examination of three things. One is slavery in America, uh, the freedom struggle in South Africa, and then the civil rights movement. And in this piece, there's a prayer protest piece. There's so many things that are examined, issues of slavery, issues of quality, Juneteenth. And so I think this, this piece is the most profound written from that period. And I think it will help us all to understand better. It's like a book. It's like reading a book on human rights and civil rights. This video is important for the College of Music primarily because it makes a statement that we're committed to equality and freedom for all and that black lives matter. And I think, I think that it is important during these times that we enlist allies because how things have always changed in America is when people stand together, not black against white, but black and white against racial injustice and inequality.